All right, I'm live. It's going on Facebook. We go live on Twitter too. And I'm recording my screen. So what's up, guys? If you're watching this from YouTube, I'm going to talk quickly about recovering from illness fast. I've been sick the last couple of days. You might be able to tell by my energy. I'm still getting over it. I'm not 100%, but I feel way better. I'm like 85%. And I'm going to share with you just what I did to help recover so quickly. I think quickly, at least. In a couple of days, I went from having some headaches and some sinus congestion, that nasty stuff. You know what I mean when you're hacking. And um, let's see. Am I still alive? I just got a phone call. Got to love it when that happens. The best time to get a phone call is when you're doing a live video. But I just want to share with you guys <clears throat> some tips, some foods and whatnot. I'll go live here on Twitter again. It looks like my video got cut off, whatever. So um, let's see. One second here. Bear with me. I've got too many things going on. Make sure this is live still. Okay. So I just want to make sure... None of these statements are, you know, intended to cure, prevent, or, you know, cure any kind of disease. You know, the statement to keep me safe, always do what you feel is right. Consult with your, you know, doctor. But what I did to alkalize my body in common sense is I took my greens, like always. I even took probably a little extra. I've been taking my reds double serving our reds which is a super fruit organic alkalizing i think it's alkalizing fruit be uh beverage mix it's like a powder <clears throat> and the b naturals so these will these got all your vitamins these will help with energy immunity and i took some vitamin d like always maybe a little bit more than normal and what else here? And I used the sanitizer when I went out, you know, to keep myself, but also others safe to uh, spray it on my hands and sometimes on my mask, even when I wear that, your cloth mask. And what's really helpful is Asante has this little catalog that actually shows you what are acidic, where disease happens and illness happens. So my body got too acidic. I was eating sugary stuff, not the best diet. <clears throat> and for me, I know personally I was running and going too fast. I wasn't sleeping enough and I put myself in a in a vulnerable uh, situation. And that's how I got sick. Otherwise, if I had been sleeping more, like one night I might have got three or four hours and then I was working nine days in a row, a lot of hours moving into my new place here just too much you know too fast doing my new working out fitness journey so sometimes you got to slow down and sometimes a sickness will help you do that it'll force you to rest recover take off from work meditate contemplate and that's good but uh that's what i did is i slept a lot. I slept like crazy. I got a ton of sleep. And like, again, common sense. I just know if I'm sick, my body will heal itself. It knows how to recover. It knows how to strengthen itself from the inside out. My immune system is strong. And I just got to give it what it needs to succeed. And that's what I did. And Asante supplements helped in addition to plenty of sleep. I think I caught up on sleep, so now I feel very well rested, and my main symptoms have gone away. The runny nose, congestion, any headaches, those are all gone. It went in and out relatively quick. I mean, it's only Monday, and Saturday afternoon, I was out doing laundry, getting shit done, and then I felt worse, and I could not go into work Sunday morning, night. So I picked up some healthy foods and you guys can take note i like almonds which happen to be 
alkalizing these almonds, whole almonds here, raw. They don't taste the best, but, you know, they're really good for you. And same with garlic is super good for you as well. I got some minced organic garlic. I know that's really good for your immune system. And like I said, Sante has a booklet here that actually shows you what's acidic and what's alkaline, whatever way you can see it. So actually over here is the alkaline stuff. And I got some organic lemon in here too. Exactly. This is a powerful message, right? I just thought I'd hop on. I was taking some time off from work and thinking about whatnot. But I was like, hey, this can help people. You know, I'm not the best at all this stuff, but I know I know a decent amount about how to be healthy. And I didn't go to a doctor. I didn't take any prescriptions. I didn't take any any kind of uh uh, medicines at all other than you know supplements and sleep right I really think if you sometimes you need 10 hours of sleep sometimes 12 hours of sleep like I lay down I rested a lot my body my mind I really needed to to recover and when I was taking nine of these or more the earth greens are alkalizing um, you know, it's alkalizing, cleansing, helps your cells heal on a cellular level. Same with the vitamin D, the reds. I was taking those way more normal. I got the B tabs. Again, you can take two to eight of these a day probably because it's got everything, everything in here basically, but in small dosages. So you can balance that out. Another thing I do is take hot drinks so you can hot teas and I like to pour in the honey because honey is really good for you. Antibacterial, antifungal, I believe. It's it's just good for you. And I took some organic or apple cider vinegar stuff because I think that's also, you know, some of the things you can kind of tell are going to be good for clearing out your system killing off any viruses or bacteria, something like vinegar, you would think that's gonna like, you know, cleanse your system, right? So pour some of that in, hot drinks, run the essential oils over here. I got this diffuser. Now it's not Asante essential oil, but I have a eucalyptus on the way. And another thing is, Asante has a vitamin C product called cell salts. So, if I had that, I'd be taking those <clears throat> at least two servings, maybe three a day, because it's got 500 milligrams of vitamin C, which is one of the top antioxidants, really healthy for killing off viruses, keeping your body safe. So I would have taken that, but that's it's on its way to my door. Same with the protein. It's not regular protein. It's not whey protein. Is actually acidic for me, but Asante's got this vegan protein um, based out of whole foods that are non dairy related. It's like organic brown rice and peas, and that protein is alkalizing. And when I take the scoop out, you can see it jumping around like the protein is I don't know how to explain it, it's, it's moving around. And um, the greens are like that too, which means it's super healthy. Where, where it will get into your cells very quickly. And I don't know, I might still be really sick right now if it wasn't for Asante supplements and a bunch of rest. I think those two is the main thing. Asante supplements gives me all the nutrition, veggie, fruit, vitamin D. I mean, and then a bunch of rest. Like when you're sleeping, that's when your body is healing. That's when your body is doing its most work is when you're asleep. So take the time to to rest and to slow down. And hopefully I never get sick again in my whole life. I mean, I might if I go too fast again and I'm not watching what I eat and whatnot. But this is the first time I got sick for quite a while. Um, yeah, this is the first time I got sick, I believe, since 
the whole coronavirus, you know, but I wasn't worried at all. I was just like, okay, this is going to pass through pretty quick. I just got to take some time off work, which honestly I wanted to because I had already worked nine days in a row. I needed a break. I don't want to get sick though, because nobody, that's not fun. And you never want to get worse sick. Fortunately, I was able to just, you know, knock it out myself, which usually I can always do. Um, and I always feel safer when I got these kind of healthy supplements because I know if I'm popping these and I'm eating pretty whole foods, clean, I'm going to be all right. And I had a bunch of, I, I made chicken. I cooked up a bunch of chicken because I wanted that protein and potatoes, a bunch of that carbs and just a bunch of calories. Like you need to feed, you need to starve the cold or whatever illness. I needed my body to have all the energy it needed to recover and to heal itself and to use the nutrition I was feeding it to recover. And basically, um, I mean, not like two days, maybe a day and a half. I'm back to normal. I'm feeling feeling better. I'm still gonna take it easy the rest of the day, and um, hydrate. Drink some of this Avion water, which is one of the best waters you can get. It's got electrolytes right in there, and I think that's it. Just snack on healthy things like almonds and alkalizing things like garlic and cinnamon and ginger and things like that that are just good for you. So I hope this video you found useful and drop in the comments below. Today I just want people to drop comments on what do you do to recover from illnesses, sinus colds, headaches, fevers, and that kind of stuff. What do you do? I didn't even have a fever. I just, I had some headaches and some sinus kind of congestion and I've been prone i've had that happen to me a lot in my life i've always kind of had some kind of sinus issues but i knocked this out really fast so i'm gonna go back to work tonight and the rest of the week moving forward but i will see you guys next time drop comments below on any um health tips that you want to share when you get over your illnesses whatever it could be common colds sinus aches like myself just drop it in the comments below and, uh, and have a great day and stay safe and stay healthy out there. Take care.